Uh, hello, this is letter to Lorraine Powell Jobs. This is Svecha Navera, uh, making a letter for you from Russia. I would like you to help me to uh, meet with Tim Cook and board of directors uh, of Apple. Uh, because I happen to be Apple logo model since 1977 and I lived in San Francisco since seven, uh, since 90... Uh, <laughs> I was Apple logo model since 77 and I lived in San Francisco since 97. And the reason of me living in San Francisco since 97 was to become a film, to make a film. So I went to film school and I made a film. I got my own original material uh, written very, very deeply in my family and my culture. Uh, and I made, a, I wrote a screenplay and uh, I made a film. I was supposed to go to TED dinner in 99, 2000, but there was supposed to be someone who must have been take me there, but those people did not do their job. And uh, then terrorist attack happened. The terrorists attacked my World Trade Center, the World Trade Center that was built for my birthday in '73. So definitely, it was against Apple, against Steve Jobs. Uh, and at that time, I still did not know about my relations to Silicon Valley, to many IT companies, to Hollywood, to recording studios. So somebody was withholding this information from my life to cause harm basically and use it for other people who are not eligible to this kind of information or using it you know because it was made especially for me as I happen to be a very important historical figure not only because of the Russian uh, Tsar's family the family that was killed in uh, 1918 in Russia not only because of my family from Soviet Union, the land of 1,000 candles founders, uh, not only because um, Pearl Harbor was made uh, uh, named uh, for me, but also because two atomic bombs was dropped on Japan. Also, they were named on my with my uh, name, relation to me, to myself, the baby. So the Apple logo was made from the baby, and my book. Uh, the Tolstoy, the book, um, oh, the Facebook book, my book that became a Facebook about my first time filmmaking, filmmaking experience, and also um, uh, Mark Zuckerberg did not pay me stock or didn't meet me. This is not public demand. My book and my personal life and life of my parents is a. Uh, basically I wrote it to make a living because I don't have any other income and uh, whoever tried to destroy my uh, basically book uh, sailing or getting my stock from Apple they basically on the way to my life uh, my family life they tried to kill all my family by 2012 they harmed family of Steve Jobs they killed him and uh, I find it totally disrespectful and totally uh, horrible uh, because um, yeah, it, it just goes uh, totally not together with what uh, everything I learned in film school. It means that every filmmaker is what they learn in film school is totally against what is going on now. So you cannot tell me that what's going on with death of Steve Jobs and not paying me stock uh, is right. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. So I would like to meet uh, Tim Cook. Maybe your children can come with me, or we can go all together to Apple. I'm willing to travel to United States again. My storage uh, is still there in San Francisco, and uh, I, I really want to visit Apple's um, Apple headquarters. I'm not uh, in any uh, KGB or anybody's site. Uh, I was supposed to get. Um, American passport in 2009, but it didn't happen. Somebody attacked me in hope I will commit suicide and died together with Steve Jobs and uh, I did not know why, so I'm making a research. Still, you can see it on Flying Strippers page on Facebook. Um, and I did not get my passport, but um, at that time I had no idea that World Trade Center was built for my birthday and terrorists attacked it. And uh, yeah, I, I think uh, it's a little bit of a strange situation because um, 
It was my story was supposed to be a happy story with the Peace uh, Nobel Prize as a result. But somehow Al Gore got on my Peace Nobel Prize time in 2007, and uh, I and Steve Jobs, we and my father, and also many of my relatives, we they tried to put us to graves. Um, uh, 